Hello, welcome back. This is Bronze 6. Um, good news is we are halfway there to getting our bronze certificate. And the uh, not so good news is this one's going to be pretty challenging. This one is going to show you how we deal with challenging pieces of music when they're a bit tricky. We break them down into little chunks, work on each little chunk and put them all back together again. So let's start. We're going to put our a, M and I, plant them onto the top three strings. The thumb, P, that goes on the bottom string, string six, and we're ready to start. Left hand is going to put some fingers on the top string. We're going to use second fret, F sharp, and the third fret, G. So we're going to go E, F sharp, and G. Okay, so for the first piece, I'll just play it through to you. And see if you can get the hang of the pattern to it. Okay, so it's mostly bottom string, top string, top string, top string. That's what the right hand does the whole time. Um, so what I'm doing is So the first thing you want to do is practice just doing that with no worries about this hand and Have a pause of the video and come back when you've got the hang of it Okay, so hopefully your fingers are getting a little bit used to that action. So now let's try the second bar. If we just work on the second bar, that's the one that goes to the third fret. So it's off, on. Of the finger close to the fret bar, thumb at the back, plenty of space to move. Okay, the next bar is the same as the first bar, um, and the last bar is where we do F sharp, second fret, and same as the second bar, it's open or off, on, off. together third open second well done so have a practice of that do whatever you need to do to work on that second bar and the fourth bar um, and then try and put it, put it together gradually. Okay, so second one. Again we're planting all our fingers, the thumb is on bottom string again. This time we're only going to be using our M finger media. really good practice because you can't do big movements with that because these fingers are staying on the strings so if you've been playing like this this will help with that so just nice and gently into the palm of the hand just practice that before you even look at the um, exercise the video now if you want to work on that. Okay, so first and third bars just open strings. The second bar is third fret, the D, and the last bar is first fret, C. Okay, let's play it all the way through for you.
of a pause and break down each bit, work on the different bars and try and put them all together nice and slowly and steadily. Okay, third one. We're going to be using our first finger. Not our first finger, our eye finger. Sorry, got the wrong hand there. Um, so we're on the third string. So practice that if you need to. Nice and gently, small movements, just curling your finger in towards your on and off. Okay, so our thumb is going to stay on the bottom string for this one and again we've got open strings to start with then we're going to use fret 2 and slightly differently now the third bar in this one also has a stopped note that's going to be the third fret. Now we've got a new symbol in this um, piece as well it's a flat sign. Um, I just don't need to worry what that means at the moment that's called a B flat there. Okay, and the piece goes. had a pause to practice that perhaps come back and rewind a little bit try and play along in time with me okay now it's going to get a little bit more tricky so we're going to have to change our thumb onto the fifth string for the second bar if you have a look at it so all the way through we've been doing the E on the bottom but if you have a look at string number five it's got the five in a circle and uh, the notes moved up a few steps um, and there's lots of changes in the other part as well so let's see what we can do so again break it down first bar is thumb on E third string open third string the second fret and then second string open now I've worked it out I can go back and try to play it in time and have a look at the right hand closely Second bar, I move my thumb up to the A and I start with my second fret on an A there. Third string, then move to the second string, open, and then first fret. Now, if that's way too tricky, it means that you need to go back and work on the first three exercises until your fingers have got used to working independently like that. It's a huge step to play in the guitar, but it's really worth working on. So don't worry if you maybe need to spend quite a bit more time on this one six. Okay, so we keep on going up. So let's start from the beginning. string, opening 
second string would be C. Keep on going out. Okay, so we end up all the way up there. We've got short ladders going up and up each time. Really good one to break down into uh, one bar chunks. So each little bar, there's four bars. We could take the third one. bar which is the bottom string and then the top string F sharp G do it a few times now I would try to put those two bars together so starting in bar three repeat that a few times, go as slowly as you need. Now the other little tip is, if it is really too tricky, in the moment, stop. Give your brain a break. Give your fingers a little bit of a shake out. Think about something else for a few seconds and then start from the beginning, putting your hands on, planting your fingers, looking at the music, making sure you're nice and calm. slower. Okay, now, good time to pause. So the last one, and if you've got this far on bronze six, uh, you're doing really really well. Um, so short ladders down, so guess what? That's going to be kind of the same thing as before but kind of backwards. Starting at the top, G. Then the next string, and then we're going to change our thumb to the fifth string. That's a tricky one because we, we're using two different strings, first fret, second string, open, and then second fret, and the next string. So. and slowly maybe practice that one on its own a few times and then finally that's crossing strings as well open second string B third string second fret A open G and the whole thing together I'll go nice and slowly maybe when you've had a really good practice broken it down come back and try this bit and play it with me maybe. Well done.